to the world, she's new to the world of network marketing, and she is here tonight to share her journey with us so far. Please give a huge round of applause for Adele. Good evening. Are we all okay? Good. So, how do you ride your donkey? Before I begin, is there any professional donkey riders in the room? I knew there'd be one, <laughs> um, <laughs> which is really good because now, uh, you know, this is going to go on really badly if we'd actually had one. Um, so, how do you ride your donkey? It's a very obscure title, but you'll get it in a bit. So um, I'm an entrepreneur, which in today's society that is bandied about left, right and centre like a label. So what is an entrepreneur? In effect, in its simplest terms, it's just somebody who has set up a business with taking risks with a view to making profit. Simple. So my business is travel, booking it, reviewing it, quoting it, and most importantly, experiencing it, which is what I like to do. So a travelpreneur is also what I am. That just means I'm able to take my business anywhere in the world. And it doesn't matter where it is, the guiding principles of my business remain the same. So as long as I have Wi-Fi, I'm good to go. I can do it anywhere. But this really comes, this whole how do you ride your donkey, comes from a question about network marketing, which is what part of the business is. Now, network marketing has been a challenge for me because I'm quite a private person. But network marketing means you have to go out and you have to speak to strangers. Not one of my favourite or exciting things to do. It's a bit like this speech. We're doing it because we need to. So it's, it's one of those things that you have to do. You have to get comfortable speaking to people, building relationships and, and those sorts of things. But let's get back to the question, how do you ride your donkey? So this comes from a story. So I'm going to share the story with you and it will put it into concept. So a man and his wife are walking along and going with their donkey towards the market. The husband tires and says, OK, I'm a little bit tired. I'm getting on that donkey. So he gets on the back of the donkey and they continue along their journey. As they're going along the journey, people are going, well, Look at that. He's on a donkey. His poor wife is standing beside him on the donkey. She looks extremely tired. That can't be right. So hearing this, he gets off the donkey and says to his wife, you get on. So she gets on the donkey. So they continue their journey along to the market. Everybody's carrying on their business. Then suddenly there's a comment, well, that can't be right. She's on the donkey, he's looking very tired. How is this right? So hearing this, they were like, oh. right, okay, right, what are we gonna do? Aha, we'll both get on the donkey. Can't go wrong with that, can ya? So we're gonna go to market, continuing on their journey. On the way to the marketplace, more comments. Look at the poor donkey. The donkey now has two people on it. The back of the donkey's gonna break. How are they doing this to the donkey? So they went, forget it, do you know what? We're getting off. So the boys get off the donkey and walk beside the donkey. This has solved the problem, surely. <laughs> no, 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 no. As they get into the market, people comment. You do not know what to do with the donkey. How are both of you standing next to the donkey looking tired and the donkey's got nobody on it? How are you doing this? So, as we talked about it, we talked about the ways of the donkey. It's pretty much like my business. When I first started, I went to people that had been in the business for a long time. So I came over here to the, all the professionals that had been in the business 10 years or so and said, excuse me, how do I ride my donkey? Because I have no idea. I've got this donkey, what do I do with it? Well, we think you should ride the donkey every day. Every day, ride it every day, take it slow and steady, steady wins the race. Thank you, you are the best people ever. Thank you so much. Then met some more people. So I went over to this side. Excuse me, people, entrepreneur, donkey riders. How do actually I ride this donkey? What do I do with it? Oh, no, no, you need to ride it every day. Ride it fast, ride it hard, do this with it. So now I'm getting rather confused. I've got people on the left telling me, ride it hard. People on the right telling me, no, steady, and steady, steady is the race. What I have found is this. It doesn't matter what I do. 
people will comment upon how and how and when I'm doing it. So all I can say to you is life and your business is your donkey. You have to find the most effective way to ride your donkey. In doing so, you will be a very happy individual. Thank you so much. Thank <laughs> you.